Brook Crossing in Pomfret, Vermont is located just five minutes from Woodstock, the quintessential New England historic town, home of great restaurants, shopping, the Woodstock Inn and Resort, and boutiques. Brook Crossing is an exquisite, historically maintained and updated residence on over 41 acres, incredibly designed by landscaped architect David Raphael. The rolling topography features two pastures, a trout stocked pool in the brook, and trails throughout. The Cape portion of the antique residence, circa 1800, was located from the Quabbin Reservoir in the 1930s and it's beautifully sited in a pastoral setting above a trout stock running stream with a reflecting pool. You will enjoy the lovely sounds of the babbling brook from all rooms in this home, as well as the crackling sound coming from any of the four wood-burning fireplaces. While maintaining the historical integrity of the original house, top to bottom renovations were completed 10 years ago by Hank Salverberg, including the addition of a great room with a gourmet kitchen with custom cabinets made of 100-year-old yellow pine, wide pine flooring, reclaimed timbers, and an informal dining and sitting area, as well as a stone fireplace. French doors easily accommodate for indoor or outdoor entertaining, and the extensive stone patios and perennial gardens make outdoor dining a delight. Throughout, you'll notice beautiful murals and floor paintings by renowned artist Kevin Paulson. With a two-car garage, this unique residence combines historic New England home character with updated modern mechanicals. Pomfret is one of the most beautiful locations in New England, with its clear running brooks and green rolling pastures, perfect for skiing, hiking, walking, and more intense pursuits like farming. The Appalachian Trail runs right up and over Pomfret on its way to Hanover, New Hampshire. You'll find Cloudland Farm here with its Angus cattle and the popular off-the-beaten-track farm-to-table restaurant. Go up and over and around the scenic Pomfret dirt roads and you'll surely find little pieces of heaven. If you're looking for some daily social life, just stop by Tigo General Store to pick up your mail and enjoy coffee and a sandwich made by one-time professional chef Chuck Gunderson. Chuck also helped start and run an alternative radio station back in the day and writes a column for the Vermont Standard. An old dilapidated barn that was for the longest time in disuse as part of the MIT Ski House property is now the splendid, big, bright, renovated Artistry Art Center, just up from the Tigo General Store. This arts organization, part of the greater Woodstock community, offers workshops, well-lit studios, galleries, and performance space. Through the large glass windows at the back of the big old red barn, you can see the face of the Suicide Six Ski Area run by the Woodstock Inn and Resort. The Woodstock Ski Runners program for local kids is operated at Six, which is a great place for locals and for families. Best of all, in under 45 minutes, you have access to Woodstock, Vermont, great skiing in nearby Killington, Silver Lake and Barnard for lovely swimming, and Hanover, New Hampshire, home to Dartmouth College, an amazing teaching hospital, and wonderful theater, arts, and culture. 